we have here a Chromecast and I'm sure by now you've heard of Chromecast what we're going to do today is hook one up to a TV that doesn't have an HDMI port a couple of years ago Comcast at least in Connecticut uh, decided to digitize its signal and scramble its signal which made about three quarters of the TVs in our house bricks Charter just recently did the same thing in its areas and this is the view we've had uh, since they've done it Com uh, Chromecast has allowed us to change this view uh, without getting boxes from the cable company in order to hook this up we are going to need a couple supplies one obviously we have the Chromecast we are going to need an AV cable in this case we're using the old yellow white and red which would be the white and red for the audio and the yellow for a composite video signal I didn't see any reason to go with component color for these TVs to finish the hookup, we're going to need a USB power adapter that allows us to plug it into the wall without having all sorts of plugs all over the place, and an HDMI to AV connector. So we have our AV connectors there and our HDMI connector there. Okay. We are now in another room where we have the same TV with the same situation, but to speed things up, it was already pre-wired in here, so we'll go straight to the finished product. Here we have the power adapter plugged in. You can see the lights on it. It's getting power, and the two, two USB cords are coming out of it, which will power the HDMI converter and the Chromecast. Now here you can see the cabling to the input on the TV going to the HDMI connector and here you can see the Chromecast going in on the right side with the power lead coming out to go that goes to the USB connector at the wall on the left side you have the audio video connections up on the top of the converter is the USB power lead that goes to the wall and by the way on the bottom which in reality is really the top since it's upside down there is a switch to switch from NTSC to PAL if you're on that system and with the TV set to the proper input you can now see we have the Chromecast connected I'm gonna now pick up my phone and bring up Netflix we're just gonna cast something there just so we can see it works now pick the TV it goes to since we have these on just about every TV and there we go in a second we'll have our pictures Okay, we have now hooked this up. We have Netflix in the bedroom here where we had nothing but fuzz before. And what we will, what we have now installed this in just about every TV in the house to give us new options and more versatility with our systems. And this includes the AV systems in the house. So I hope it works for you. The cost for the adapter was 25 bucks. The Chromecast, you know, is 35 bucks. The cable I had in the basement and the wall connector you can get for between five and 10 bucks. Okay, that spells it out. So for under 100 bucks, you can hook the whole thing up.